on another note though, Wick, I was watching ATL last night, uh, Atlanta, the yeah. Donna Glover show, and yeah. out shout of nowhere, out to, shout out to Donna Glover. The, yeah, uh, out of nowhere, all I hear is straight from the deck beating on the show, man. Yeah. I was like, wait a minute. I, first of all, I heard Wicked in the background. I was like, it's Wicked in my damn house. What the fuck's going on in here? Quit singing that damn song around me, Wick. Yeah, I was, I was, I was shocked myself. You know, I said. <laughs> You know, I said, you know, people called me and said, man, you the greatest. I said, why? They said, you on uh, the show Atlanta. It was actually, it was uh, it was season four. It was the yeah, grand finale. That's crazy. Uh, episode 10. So I, I, I definitely got a shout out to, you know what I'm saying, Paperboy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? On yeah. there, man, Donald Glover. Man, the whole cast, that, that's my favorite class. That cast was actually in a movie with Idris Eldridge. It was a Western. Mm -hmm. He had that same exact cast. I them. know what you're talking about. But I saw what, that. Uh, yeah. uh, Jay-Z produced that movie. Did he? Yeah, it was a good-ass movie. Oh, that, I loved it. I yeah. loved it. With um, the old I, school Western yeah, folk. Yeah, and, yeah. My, and my favorite uh, actress was in there. What the pretty eyes was she Regina played? King. Regina. Hey, Regina. I know exactly what you're talking about. Hey, Regina. Now, now you can forget her. You know what I'm saying? Then that you gave me a name back. <laughs> Regina, hey, how you doing? I loved all the movies. How but did anyway. you feel hearing your music, the impact, 20 years later, on the season finale of one of the biggest television sitcoms for African Americans to date? What I felt, I felt, I felt great because of this. Talk to this me. is why I felt great. I felt great because no one in that cast is is my age. Mm. So therefore, come on. I look at it like this ge that generation. Now I don't know how old each one of them are, but I'm sure they they my generation. We was okay. listening to the shit. Okay, so therefore, but but the, but they have passed it on to the generation below uh, them that is watching them. Oh. So therefore, I looked at it as you know what I'm saying. It, you know, it's been it's been handed it's down, living. and people are enjoying it. That's hard. You understand that's what I'm hard. saying? So that's because they could have went and got any song. You know, any any song in the world that could have uh, did sta uh, status quo, yep. got the same old records that, yep. that that we regurgitate over and yep. over and over in, the, in those type of situations. Facts. So to come get us independent, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I ain't never had a major record deal and I'm sitting right here to this day. Come on. Um, you know, but so to go, to go get us, uh, to put that song on there, it shows the strength of, of that song, but mm -hmm. also... That you know what I'm saying. That uh, what I have pivoted to right now, and this may not make sense to a lot of people, but what I have pivoted pivot to right now, the the my heart right now is affecting that old stuff. Mm. Even if at the time I made it, my heart went in the same place. Damn. It might have didn't prosper like it's supposed to because not only was my heart not in the right place, maybe everybody around me heart wasn't in the right place, <laughs> and a lot of people had to drop off. You know, from yeah. around me for me to receive the blessing that yeah. I got. So now the song is like it's brand new, but yeah, straight from the deck is a hell of a goddamn record. <laughs> That's a bad Go ahead and give me some record. of that. Can you give me some that's of that? A, that's a hell of a record. You know what I'm saying? They will not let it. The new generation like. They just won't let it down. That's a motherfucking record right there. That's a hit record. I mean, but see, that's the thing about it, too. That puts you in an elite class because everybody don't have that record that makes it decade after decade after decade, let alone getting synced into one of the biggest shows of all time. And and not and not put into a portal to where, where the, a label, a major label is choosing mm -hmm. to work that record. I Hey, I got, let me get a, you know, hypothetical, but let me well, get a they over that catalog, so they trying to make some money out of the catalog. So they trying to make money out of the catalog. So, so a lot of that stuff was just business. Mm -hmm. This was personal. This was, the, you know, Donald Glover, the staff. Yeah. Everybody saying, you know what? You know, let's let's get a, the real kings of Atlanta, you know, saying they're due, you know, and let's go and, and play that record. Because I got, you know, I got an inside source to say that, you know, they when they played that record in there, it was unanimous. And there was other records up against it. You know, Ooh. major records that, that, you, that when you be leaving here that you really be playing. <laughs> Some of those records was in there be high. You understand what I'm saying? I wish but, you. But everybody else said no. That record right there. And that's what I heard from the inside. So, yeah. damn well, that makes me feel good. Well, I mean, I enjoyed it just as a black man seeing another black man get his flowers when you least expect them. Well, no, I would, I would, you know, Bun B had already told you. What? He told you that I was a legend. He told, he told he me. He didn't mean he it. Me he told me eye. that he didn't mean Bun it when B I talked to him later. He in my eye. He said, do not let b High hate on you. <laughs> this is what this man said right there. Look me in my eyes and said, do not let b High hate on you and tell you you're a legend. You are a legend. And if he says that, Will Smith him. 
<laughs> Bubby also said he was gonna bring us some trio burgers up here. And I ain't seen now trio burger. So that lets me know right there that he was lying. Maybe he did. He bring, said that maybe in the same did, Maybe he did bring some trio burgers, but not just to you. Ooh, how about that? Bond, don't let me find out that you've been running out with the trio burgers, the best damn burger in America. Maybe, but how about fucking back? Maybe they just he didn't want you to have. Them.